Hello, this is MechaJ101, and I'm in the process of building a new Sterling engine, and this new Sterling engine is going to have a water jacket very much like this one, <clears throat> and the water jacket's made out of steel cans, so they rust away, so <clears throat> this is a little um, sacrificial anode experiment that I have going here, so just two pieces of can in each one, this one is, and just a normal tap water, so let me get this one out here, so this is just some can, um, and I know that the cans have a plastic coating on them, something like that, some sort of plastic coating to keep them from rusting when the food is in them, but when I solder them and stuff, the plastic coating all comes off, so as you can see, some places it's rusting and some places it's not, but this has only been sitting in this water for two days, and it's rusting pretty bad already. There's a lot of orange stuff in there. This one, same type of can, just the other half of it, and um, same. Sc I scratched it, but I soldered a um, piece of zinc there, and that zinc costed me one cent. So, I mean, if it keeps my engine from um, rusting and getting the water all orange and yucky like that, or if it keeps my engine um, from rusting out, so if it makes it last even like a month more, one penny is definitely worth it. So, I mean, this is just one of the um, newer American pennies. Um, so, these are just one cent, and the newer ones are not call it solid copper like the old ones. These ones have... Um, are copper plated zinc, so zinc is um, can be used as an anode or a sacrificial anode. So the anode or the zinc actually gets eaten away um, and produces an electrical um, kind of like a battery. It produces electrical potential that keeps the um, steel from rusting. So very, I mean it's still shiny as when I put it in there. So I mean it works great. So, so yeah, it's working pretty good, so I'll probably put a couple of those inside of my water jacket to keep it from rusting, and it should be good. So, that's about it. Thanks for watching.